Everything seems to still be working. All right, so hey there, when the Skull Goblin Crash 3, uh, take two here on level 25. Uh, so uh, my kitchen is being gonna get repainted today, right? So uh, in order to uninstall a light fixture, it was thought a good idea to cut the power from the kitchen. Turns out, no one knew this, but my room's power is connected with the kitchen's power, and here we go. Uh, the, the power dropped off right as I was doing my outro after beating this level. So here we go! Hey, it's called Bug Out! That was like, what? Bug what? Why a bug? Because this is Bug Out! Yeah! So I'm gonna replay this, that's fine. I only played this level. Uh... I had... Whoa, I destroyed that crocodile by accident. That was cool. Uh, yeah, so... This will not be a fresh run. Like, I have knowledge of things. And that's gonna have an impact on how I play, sadly. Like, I'm not gonna try and fake me playing this anew for the first time. Like, that's just not gonna work. We're just gonna... Hey, man, we're just gonna play with the hand we've been dealt. So, look at that. It's a crocodile. He's so happy he jumps. That snake is so happy he slithers. It's how you can measure the happiness of insects like crocodiles. Anyways, I, this place is kind of cool because you start outside and then it leads into the Egyptian tomb motif. And yeah, see, it's bug out because we got our bug out. Oh, uh, uh, I'm trying not to rely as much on the bazooka because it is totally a momentum killer. Let's see here, if you're smart, you're gonna wait. Yeah, I've dealt with Lightbug before in another video game called Crash Bandicoot 2, Crash the Moose, Fleet the Goose. That game does not exist and never will. That's just a sad reality of being. There's a box there that this guy just destroyed all the time. Also, I lost a few lives before here that I won't now. Uh, this gem ride leads to another gem. I know I don't have all of them, so I think it's like that gem chain you have often, right? At the end of these games. So, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna lose like five lives there this time. <laughs> you know that? They give us basically like a little makeshift little muncher run. Just got Whoa! Wow! Uh, that never happened before. That was kind of cool. And I get hit by him at the last second, like I always do. That's just a special moment we share. And toss him down. And man, okay, so this gave me issues a few moments ago. I got a better idea of how this works a little bit. Let's be generous with our definition of words. Yeah, so that happens. There's a way to skip him and you can s save a little bit of time because like there's only one bug But that's not true and that's the key here. Yeah, don't mind these here. You got to splat down. It's fine. We'll come back So like you do all that, you know, it's all nice and good And then I think I messed it up Like is there a way? Yeah, you can do that. Then you get it again. Then you can do a little jump here. Like, the only reason for all this is these guys here, which can be kind of a menace. Well, yeah, sign, but I think are gonna be point. Oh, shoot. Cool. Okay, I miscounted. Uh, because I dropped out, I miscounted. But, like, I think I did the wrong thing. Anyway, this place, like, I must have spent easily 15 minutes just trying to figure this place out uh, so, so you get the benefit from my research and then I forget about what I need to do anyways it's pretty good you see you can skip ahead and when you do that lets you like like do here all of this early without having to worry like including like pressing a button possibly anyways now you're back here you can go like hey bug because see like doing everything costs time and this lets you do this like in relative safety well yeah sign yeah sign then you can just pound down okay well i might have destroyed some things 
I guess. Ah, uh, shoot. I don't know if I've destroyed all the... By now, I must have destroyed all the blocks here. So here, yeah, there's a... Uh... Okay, yeah, if you're collecting apples, you're fine. So, the counter there does not count nitroglycerin? Like, is that a different part of the count? I'm not sure anymore, actually. Well, since I've done this, I can very safely return and take care of them because of this extra light, so... Huh, I haven't considered that, but yeah, there you go. So now I know what I'm clear, all the boxes are done down there, I'm now abandoned by the light. I don't know where my platform is. I'm just kind of... Alright, there we go. <laughs> it's all we need. It's still a little very... more than a little uh, awkward. Man, normally you fly all around these columns, but uh, it doesn't have any light. That's how it works out. Alright, so where are I? So this guy, I just... Spiky guy, I just never know how to handle. Like, I, I understand they're supposed to jump up at a certain level and show him a good time and, like, he reciprocates by deflating him like a balloon, but that's just not part of my scene, man. Alright, now we're outside. We're relatively okay. Look at that. There is another bug that I can eat. Oh, that guy's in the way. I don't know where I am right now. Alright, just oddly floating around away. Hoping for the best and all that, yeah. Yeah, see? This one, you actually have a green thing. I missed a box somewhere? Where? I have no idea where I missed a box. Well, I don't want to clear the level because... That's going to force me into fighting the boss, and that always just makes me mad. So I guess I'll start over? I missed a box somewhere. That's... swell. Oh, you don't even keep the pink crystal that way. Huh. Was it there? Because I saw there that he smashed into a box. So it might just have been this. Like, just the box left in the dark. Uh... Well... There we go, yeah. Was that one miss? Also, I almost fell in that pit last time, but I didn't, and there I knew it was there. Yeah, I just missed one box in the shadow. And there, well, okay, so this took significantly less long than it did my first time, so 
Now I have time to do something blind. I have time to check out this third boss. Like, I don't know what to expect. I don't know, like, it's kind of, I guess it's the last boss without, like, we're not even done with loop one, but that's my one option. So let's check out Neocortex. He's holding like a sword or flag. He's ready. Oh, he's gonna speak. He's nervous. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is the part where I'm supposed to be angry, full of rage, incensed beyond belief. Once again, you have outsmarted and outspun my best henchmen. I should be rather upset, shouldn't I? And in fact, we're furious! But it seems you have overlooked one small detail, you little orange delivery boy. Now that you have gathered all the crystals, all we have to do is take them from you! He's not wrong. Like, uh, ultimately, he is absolutely correct in that assessment. Uh, Alright, well, now he's mad. Now Crash he's... Bandicoot for the last time! Give the crystals to me! Man, his face shape is, like, perfect. Oh, jeez, our masks are fighting. Alright, he only has three hits, but I have none, so... Alright, well, I, I tried to hit him there and it did nothing. I've got like a shield of some kind. Uh, something killed me. I don't know if it was a shot or the barrier in the middle of the room. Like, well, what's the... What are we doing here exactly? Yeah, you, you got your little shots there. It's pretty cute. It's adorable. Alright, oh, I have a bazooka. Mm, or I don't. And now we've got mines. All right, that's exciting. Um, oh, he didn't have his shield on while he was laying down mines. Was that when I was supposed to get in? Maybe. No, he still... No, he doesn't care about me at all. Okay. Yeah, I'm holding the bazooka button and nothing is happening. I can't bazooka during this boss fight. I'm supposed to spin near a mine? Like, I'm just... I don't know what to do here. Well, I can't run... Like, I didn't run into it on purpose, to be fair, but I... Okay, so I thought about spinning it. Spinning... Like, what's that wang sound? Okay, that's just me bouncing on the shield. Okay. I, uh, yeah, things are happening. He did turn- dude, really? So, that I think implies that he did shut off his shield post-mine for like, a second. I don't know why he did that, but I did hear the sound effect of his shield for reasons. So wait until he's done tossing them around. Yeah, and it shuts off, and then I, but, okay. Like, of course I'm never gonna get a hit, because my hit is involved with lasers. This is very awkward. <laughs> Yay, I did it! Alright, I caused pain. Oh jeez, I just knocked him in this pit! I just flushed him down! <laughs> Okay, all right, well, now we're gonna go back to the- oh jeez, all right, so now they're doing this to fight, got it. Meanwhile, Cortex very slowly attacks me. Rude. These guys are dangerous. Am I stuck? I, yeah, they're off cam- like, can a camera stay back? No, like, it's- I think they move in a pattern though, but still, like getting ambushed like that, it's, 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 it is what it is. Like when you have no hits, it feels kind of cheap. But I think they move in a figure eight pattern. It's 
kind of weird though how the masks are like fighting physically. I guess one strat would be to like follow them. That way you're sure not to be surprised. But yeah, they are always go to the same places. Alright. Got it. Got that figured out. Alright. It's a puzzle boss. Figure out what's going on. Alright. They're out. Now what are you two doing? Um. That's scary. Okay. Meanwhile, get shot at. Okay, well this one, like, you get, like, ample warning at the very least. It's mine time, Mr. Guy. Knock this guy out into his explosive. No, you, you, in the hole, in the hole, in the vacuum of space. There you go. Alright, I got winged feet, speed shoes. I can run now? What? Alright, I can dance too! Yeah, that's right. Oh, getting. I wanted to try them out, but I got vacuumed up by my warp hole. Oh, that looked like it hurt. Defeated again! This is not fair! Maybe I should retire to a nice big beach with a nice big drink. I mean. And a woman with nice big bags of ice for my head. I mean, can you retire? There are still the gems. We still have a chance to triumph. <laughs> this is true. This is accurate. But can you retire when you're a villain? Like, I feel like that implies he already has the means to retire. Well, considering all the machines he can build, yeah, retirement wouldn't be an issue, would it? He's doing this because he wants to. Well, he wants the power. Like, money gets you only so much power, you always need more. I mean, this is clearly not the end, like I said, like, I'm not even done with loop one. Um, but we gotta go through this here. I, I'm gonna take this moment to reiterate, when Crash gets to be Crash, this game is excellent. Uh, you need to not let it go into your head, though. You have to realize it's a lot more fair than the first two, and if something looks silly, if something looks implausible, you're probably doing it wrong. At least at this level of the game. Uh, things are gonna get harder, things might get a bit more unreasonable, but up until now, like, anytime I got mad was mostly always me just tackling things the wrong way. You know, people have said, hey, Raokao, like, I, as a kid, I love the plane parts, and I love the motorcycle parts, and I just want to make sure you realize that that's fine. That is an extremely okay position to have. Uh, there are different game genres out there, and they will, uh, you know, please different people. If I'm going to be driving a plane, like, I'd rather it be Star Fox or Gradius. Uh, these are just kind of too slow and too finicky for me, but I can see how they can appeal to peep, so... Like, my my taste is not absolute, and that is a good, wonderful thing. Oh, but no, this, uh... This boss here was pretty interesting. Like, because of plot reasons, you need to do it in one shot, so I was a bit of Like, I was just afraid because, you know, I had 20-ish lives. I don't I... I you, you learn by death, by figuring out what's going on. I was a little afraid of... I like I don't know, because I hadn't done like an in-game save in a while. So I didn't know how things would go. Whoa, this is Neighbors with Sonic Adventure. Huh, I hadn't realized that. Very different games. I'm assuming this auto-saves? Well, I'm assuming I'm gonna get dumped back. Yeah, right back here in the HUD. So there we go, you know what, let's go, let's go do a hard save. Uh, next time, uh, we're gonna be looking out what's going on in Space Central, like, Super Orb. Those are just meaningless words being uttered. I'm going in this platform. No, I don't, I don't want to save again. I saved enough, alright, okay, phew, alright. We're out of its grasp, we're gonna be okay. At uh, this nice little, uh, table here. No, you don't press the button. You gotta click a thing to stop the video. 